Hey folks, I'm Jack Fawcett and welcome to this demo and overview of this really cool series of pedals by DCW Pedals called the Marsha series, which are three different styles of dual Marshall flavored overdrive. <laughs> We have the Madame Marsha, we have the Mrs. Marsha, and we have the Miss Marsha. Now, what's kind of cool, they're all dual overdrives, and what's cool is the right side of them is all the same. It's a JTM style overdrive that has treble bass volume and gain. So you can use this a number of different ways. You can use it as a standalone boost. You can use it as a boost with the overdrive. You can use it as its own overdrive. You can use it as a tone shaping tool. That's standard on all three pedals. Now, what differentiates them from each other is the left side. So we'll start with this one. This is the Mrs. Marsha, which is kind of like a hot rotted plexi sort of sound. It's kind of a vintage pushed. So you have volume, gain, tone, and a fat knob. Now the fat knob is really cool, kind of affects the mid range and the bass a little bit. It just gives it, you know, you can get more of a, a bit more of a scooped sound. If you go this way, you can get more of a vintage style warm drive if you go this way. This one kind of has flavors of like the governor circuit, the Marshall governor circuit. Uh, it's not just, it's not a governor clone, but it's kind of in that realm kind of a little bit in that sort of, you know, governor, full-tone, plimsoll sort of realm of pedals. Really fat, thick, overdriven, distorted, but it's not too over the top. You can still, you know, you can back off your volume a little bit and clean it up as a nice warm character that gets into it. It kind of makes me think of like 1970s, 19 into early 1980s drive not super super heavy certainly not up to like jcm 900 territory but a really really cool classic marshall side this again works really well also if you pair it with this you can use this as a clean boost you can use it to get just insanely saturated tones this is the mrs marcia kind of has this cool copper finish on this one now, the what is described as the most sophisticated one of the bunch, the Madame Marsha, which is this side of the circuit is based on DCW Sunrise Overdrive, which is his take on the famous Marshall Blues Breaker Overdrive. Now, this one has volume gain, it has edge, and it has cut. The cut can help you take back some of the really you know, if it's too edgy, if it's, you know, if it's a little bit too, especially at louder volumes, if you're using the boost side with it, if it's just a lit, got a little too much harshness on the edge, you've got three levels of cut here, which can really, really help. And of course the edge really dramatically affects the tone. So it's kind of like a tone, but it just affects it a little bit differently. It, 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 it affects the gain to my ear a little bit differently than just a normal tone knob. This one is really, really great in particular if you're familiar with the Blues Breaker circuit. If you use it into an amp that's already a little bit warmed up, and then of course, because this one has both the, you know, you can really, really push an amp into just soaring territory with this pedal. I've always liked the DCW Sunrise Overdrive anyway, the single standalone. And so the Madame Marsha, this is a great one if you're looking for a blues breaker style circuit. Lastly, we have the Miss Marsha. This is the hot rod, the snarl, the JCM style. This is the heaviest one for those of you who are looking for a really thick, modern, higher gain tone. This side is based off of the DCW Tomahawk, which is also, again, is a, that is a rocking pedal. And this one gives you uh, more typical controls like you would expect from a Marshall. It's got volume, gain, tone, and presence. So you've got a lot of tone shaping with this one, and it just, this one kind of gets that really chunky, thick, heavy bottom end, you know, great for really heavy rhythm, of course, great for super high lead tones and everything. It's a lot of saturation, a lot of drive, a lot of aggression out of this pedal. So there are three different levels of really cool Marshall flavored overdrives from DCW pedals. And again, you know, based on circuits that he also does and but adding this JTM sort of style overdrive on the other side that you can boost it with, it's a really cool idea for a series and they all sound really, really, you know, it's interesting because they have that British Marshall character, but they really show you how diverse that Marshall character has been over the years and everything, you know, right from 
the kind of cleaner, bluesier, early sound all the way up to a much more modern high gain tone, and then this one kind of sitting snug in the middle. So you just heard to start it out, I was using a Lust for Tone Lust caster and using both of the sides engaged at once on each of these pedals. So using the JTM style drive with the kind of character side. For the next part, I'm going to use a Music Man Mariposa, and I'm going to just plug in the character side so that you can hear that with humbuckers, and, and, and you know, it's really, really cool when you get the whole thing rip-roaring, but just using this side really shows a little bit more the differences between the character of, you know, the, the really individual voicing of the, the pedals. So for the next part, I'm going to use the Music Man Mariposa, which is a dual humbucking guitar. For this, I'm plugging into a Fender Bassman. You know, settings are, are the same on the Bassman, obviously, for, for each pedal. Let us know in the comments, which one do you like best? Which fits your playing style best? What do you think of these pedals? Have you played DCW pedals before? Let us know in the comments. I'm Jack Fawcett. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe. Check out the DCW Pedals Marsha series. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Thank mm -hmm. you.